Hi everyone, so I am back with another makeup tutorial look and this one is my second way of how to, how you can wear blue eyeshadows in your everyday look. Um, I really like the way this one came out. It is very, still a subtle way to wear a blue eyeshadow. You could definitely, if you don't want to do blue, you could definitely do a different color if you like. You could definitely change up the colors that I did for this look. And I really like the way it's paired up with the lips as well. It's just... It's just, you know, it's still like a natural kind of look, but I feel like it still has like a peach, a peach, a peach tint to it because I did use an orange on top of the other lipstick that I did, but I forgot what it's called. But I really like this way, the way this look, let me zoom in for you. And it's just a, you know, a neutral, it's very subtle blue eyeshadow and there's also blue on the bottom. And then with the other colors that I have with it, it's just, you could wear this every day and it's not going to be like, oh, I'm wearing blue, you know, sometimes it's a little, I, mean, I myself even get a little scared wearing blue eyeshadow because I don't want to look like Mimi. No one does. So that's enough chatting and let's just get this tutorial started. Alrighty, so I am going to prime my eyelid with a paint pot and this one's called Painterly from MAC. And I'm going to put that all the way to my brow bone. And I'm going to take this eyeshadow right here called Soft Brown with a fluffy brush. I'm going to put that above my crease. I am going to take this eyeshadow right here called Cork with another blending brush. And then I'm going to put that in my crease. Actually, above my crease, I lied. Blend that one out as well. I am going to take this blue eyeshadow right here. I don't know, I believe this eyeshadow might be discontinued, but any blue would work. And I'm going to pick up with a flat shader brush. And I'm going to put that all over my eyelid. Now all I need to do is take a clean blending brush and slightly blend that one into the cork eyeshadow. Now I'm going to take another darker blue eyeshadow. I, this one I know is discontinued. I'm just going to pick a smidge up. That's quite a bit. Ooh. Then I'll put that underneath my lash line just to give it some definition. I'm just going to take a white eyeliner and just tightly my um, waterline. I'm going to take this eyeshadow right here. It's called Vanilla from MAC. I'm going to put that underneath my brow bone and blend down. A Virgin from Naked, the Naked palette. Just put a smidge on. I'm just going to put the Virgin in the inner corner of my eye as well. Now I'm just going to align my eye with a gel eyeliner and a fine tip brush. Now I'm just going to pick up a little bit of the black eyeliner, whatever's left of the black eyeliner, I'm just going to put underneath my lash line. I'm going to take a pencil brush and blend it out. I'm going to put some fake eyelashes on. I'm using these right here. They're by the House of Lashes. So I'm going to put those on my eyes, on my eye, and then I'm going to show you what I'm going to do to the rest of my face. I am going to take this blush right here, it's called Honey Jasmine, I believe this one is discontinued with a flat shader, not a flat shader brush, a blush brush, I'm just going to put that on the apples of my cheeks. Take this right here, I believe it's, it's Belightful, and I am going to use it just to like highlight my 
cheekbones. And for lips, I'm going to take this color right here by Brudo. Bru I don't know how to say this name. Um, and it's called Dolly. Put that all over my lips. And I just took this orange color from, I believe it's L'Oreal. An electric orange. It doesn't have its brand. Maybelline. From Maybelline. I just put that on top of it and it came give it gave it this like this peach peach peachish color to it. And I really like it with this look. Hope you guys like this look. Give it a try and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.